Hi guys, it's Lizzie. So today I'm going to be reviewing Trial by Fire by Josephine Angelini. Now this is a fantasy parallel universe book. Basically what happens is this girl by the name of Lily is kind of allergic to everything it feels like. She's always running really high temperatures, a lot of food her stomach can't handle, and even though doctors have examined her and done multiple multiple tests they can't find anything wrong with her. Now Lily has this friend named Tristan who has been her best friend since forever and she is kind of in love with him but didn't think he was in love with her and one night she gets really hurt by him and in a moment of just kind of being very meh about everything and just feeling very down this voice in her head asks her if she wants to get away and she says yes and suddenly she's in another universe. I'm gonna get more in depth in a couple of seconds but in case you don't want any spoilers I did really enjoy this book. I gave this book four out of five stars. I really liked the world and because of that there were a couple of moments that were very confusing plot wise but because of how great the world was it made up for it long term. There were a couple of moments where I was reading and I would be like, wait, what just happened? And I'd have to go back, but overall I really enjoyed this and I'm really excited to pick up the second book, but I haven't yet. So I won't be reading the second book yet, but as soon as I can get my hands on a copy, I definitely will be. So getting into the spoiler e bits, as I said, I really, really loved this world. I loved the whole witch side to it. I felt that it was very fitting since it was Salem that they went the switch approach and I loved the fact that she kind of got to learn that whereas in one world she was the weakest link, in this world she's one of the strongest links. And I really liked the whole like Lily Lillian bit because as I've mentioned from other books that I've read in the past, I love parallel universe ideas. I think it's one of the coolest thinking styles just being like what if there was another universe what if you know I did something slightly different and in this case it's not only the people that are doing things differently but the government and the universe and all of this and how if you walk between the other worlds you can find worlds where you see what has failed so I really really loved this world and I can't wait to see where the author takes these characters because she has such an amazing build done in this first book that I think the second book is just going to be phenomenal and I think it's actually a trilogy because what book isn't a trilogy these days? So I'll definitely be excited to see what happens in the series. I like that in the parallel universe there is this Tristan character but she doesn't fall for him. You don't you expect her to go for, or at least I expected her to go for Tristan, so when she doesn't and she ends up, you know, falling in love with Rowan, I was like, this is perfect. Because I loved that even with the parallel universe, it showed that, you know, you can't go changing everybody. Like, people that hurt you may hurt you again, but you can find somebody different. I guess I'm more so looking at it from Lily's point of view, because there is that whole, like, Rowan going to Lily after Lillian. So I guess it's eh. But either way, I actually really enjoyed Rowan as a character and I'd love to see more from his side in the future books, but I don't know if we will um, since majority of this book was told from Lily's point of view, but there was also a little bit from Lillian and a couple other characters. I would love to see more of Rowan in the second and third book. Um, but we'll see what happens. I definitely would recommend this. If you're wanting something fantasy, um, this is definitely a really good one to pick up, which is great because uh, this book club that I've started at my school, our theme for December is fantasy and such, so I'm reading a lot of fantasy books this month, as well as I just had a bunch of fantasy books on my TBR. So this is a great book. I definitely recommend it. If you've read Trial by Fire and you want to let me know what you thought about it, leave it down below or tweet it at me. Um, Twitter is the best way to reach me. If you ever want to know my reviews on books besides looking at Goodreads, you can always tweet me. Um, I'll put my Twitter right here. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos like this by clicking that subscribe button, you'll get five videos a week, one Monday through Friday. 
and I will talk to you in my next video.